All right, so this is the video about how do I use the metronome. So the very first thing you were supposed to do is pick a song. So I chose um, Asusa Spectacular. You're supposed to then figure out what the tempo marking is. So right here in the upper left corner, it says March tempo, quarter note equals 124. So then I go over to my metronome online and I look for 124. So I see 120 and 126. So let me see what 126 looks like. Yeah, it's pretty quick. I'm gonna keep it there for now. I don't know if there's any way to adjust this down. I might be able to. Uh, maybe not. All right, so I'm gonna try the 126 and if that's too fast, then I can go to the 120. So here's me playing the alto sax part in Asusa Spectacular at that tempo. So then what I have to do is I got to get that beat in my head. So I might tap it or I might discount it. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And then when I'm ready, I'll count myself off. So I'm going to set the phone down so I can play. One, two, here I go. Three, four, one, two, three, four, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Two, three, four. Two, three, four. So that kind of gives you the idea. I will say with the saxophone, it's kind of hard to hear it. So you definitely need to find, um, um, you kind of have to really make sure that you're in the right place on your rest. Cause at times it did seem like I was off a little bit. So the big thing here is going to be trying to figure out like, can I get it loud enough so I can hear both? Um, let me do another example. Let me shut off this. Started it again. So here's Centurion. Once again, I'm in the top left corner. Allegro is my marking. So on my metronome. Whoops. Very delicate. <laughs> I'm going to look for 120. Click on it. And that's already starting. So that's obviously a little slower than the last tempo marking I had. So then I'm going to set my phone down, and then when I'm ready, I'm going to count myself off at the beginning. One, two, here I go. And if you were following along, that was measure 29. So, I mean, it was a little bit easier with that one because there's so much space you can find your rest. Um, I would just say if you're a high schooler, play with it. Like, really, I mean, I know your music's a lot harder, but there's definitely, um, like, checkpoints. Like, you can make yourself checkpoints. Like, okay, I'm just going to play, like, beginning to six and see if I end up there with the beat. I mean, that works perfectly fine. Um, this is supposed to be a tool to help you. So take advantage of this. Don't, don't just blow it off because, um, you really could, um, get a lot out of this. And I'll explain more of that in, um, our meeting this week. If you have any questions, let me know.